What's up guys? I wanted to take a minute in this video to do an unboxing of a pistol light that I think is a great high value option. This is the Warriorland Crossbow and this particular light is a laser light combo and it has a lot of things going for it. Full disclosure guys, the company did send this out to me. So let's go ahead and get it out and I have to say that it is packaged very well. You can see here it does have the standard rail mount. Uh, just to show you guys some of the features, the way that this looks, uh, you can attach to your firearm uh, very easily using the screw. You can see here this is something that is going to lock firmly in place. Uh, now you do have a switch on the bottom here and what the, that switch is for is for switching between a few of the options of this particular laser light. Uh, now just to show you guys, the, the controls are ambidextrous, so you would be able to reach them uh, depending on whether you are a right-handed or a left-handed shooter. Uh, but just to show you some of this, you can see there just a simple click and we do have a very bright light, this 800 lumen light. And of course, that's just with a simple click. If I press and hold and then release, you will see that the light goes off. Now, if I were to change the position of this switch, I'm going to take it to the center position. And now what you will see is, uh, you might be able to see it, you might not. Uh, okay, yeah, you're not going to be able to see it, but basically what that does is it turns on the light and the laser. And there, in this example, you can see just the laser, okay? And again, it works just like it does with the light. If I just click it, it will stay on just fine. However, if I press and hold, when I release it, it will go off. Now, of course, this is a rechargeable light okay this is something that you don't have to worry about getting the batteries for and just right here in the display you can see there is your battery strength for the particular device right now very nice very nice very heavily built very heavily made and you can see there how that laser is not going to shine it into the camera and of course you can see your options here okay now let's set this aside and just to show you what else you get in the box Okay, you do get the book that tells you a little bit more about it, and you also get your charging cable. Let's go ahead and get that out. Okay, here is our charging cable. You can see there uh, we get an Allen wrench. Now this is going to be for the adjusting of that laser. Okay, you can adjust the laser, I do believe, as far as your point of aim, point of impact, that sort of thing. Uh, I've not read the book on it yet. This is me just opening the box and showing it to you guys. But in the future, I'm sure that I will be able to fill you in on how that is done. Just to go ahead and pull some of this other stuff out. There's your book. Looks like you get a few tools, including Phillips screwdriver, and some of the other accessories that you get with this particular light. But that's something for a future video, something that I'm definitely going to be doing in the future with this. Uh, but for now, I want to get this mounted up and show you guys what it looks like when mounted to a firearm. Just to show you guys what it looks like, here we have my Glock 19 Gen 4. I've got it mounted up to the firearm. It's very easy. What you get in this bag are basically some different rail adapters. Uh, now that I took a couple of minutes to, uh, to read through the book and I can give you a little bit more info on that. So depending on how your rail is made, will uh, affect which of these adapters you may need. For me, for the Glock 19, straight out of the box, and it fits on there very well. And what you'll simply do is you'll just loosen this screw, and it is uh, where you can push it in and actually open those jaws up, slide it into position, 
and you can see that it is ambi of course you know very easy to depending on which direction you need of course to also show you these are the adjustments for windage and elevation of the laser as well you can see there a little opening there as well as on the side that's how you will adjust that laser to get it accurately it's always a good idea to have a light on a defensive firearm and i really like how this one is made it is very solid and i do look forward to getting it out to the range uh, the charging cable is magnetic just to show you you can see here so you just plug it just get it close and it will lock in well and of course i'm doing it with one hand on camera so it wants to uh, be just a little different but you can see just like that right there and then of course just plug that in to charge very nice i believe that the amount of time that it can run it's several hours according to the documentation uh don't have it here at the moment but it does have a good long run time and of course it is rechargeable so it's something that you can uh, easily charge it back up you don't have to worry about messing with batteries very nice fits on my glock 19 very nicely you can see how it looks there kind of sets flush with the front of the gun i've seen some depending on what you're running that do stick out much further particularly with the glock 19 but I like how this looks. I really like the compact look. But guys, I'm going to leave a link to Warrior Land down in the description of this video where you guys can go down and pick up one of these at their Amazon store. And again, full disclosure, they did send this out, but I'm really glad that they did. Thanks to you guys over there at Warrior Land. I really appreciate it. I think that this is a very, very well-made optic. And I'm going to be doing some additional videos in the future using this just to kind of show you guys how it's holding up, that sort of thing. But for now, guys, thanks for watching. Check out the rest of the videos on my channel. Be sure to subscribe. Check out all the links down in the description below. Go over to Warrior Land, check out their site, and pick you one up if you are in the market for a flashlight for your firearm. Guys, thanks for watching. Check out all the links down below, and we'll see you next time.